Um, I'm Will Kiliar. I'm Chief Payments Officer for Dynamics in Europe, Middle East, Africa. Dynamics uh, was founded to solve one of the largest issues in payments and financial services. And actually what we've done is solve many, and we will continue to do so. We're Series C, um, raised $110 million to date over the last eight years. The last round was led by MasterCard and CIBC Bank in Canada. I'm going to talk with you a little bit about our products that we currently have and the product development that we've done this year. And then I'll move into how these can solve problems for banks and other financial institutions. Let's go to the card. So what do we produce? We produce a, a consumer electronic device in a card form factor. So your mind can go wild thinking about this as a computerized device and what can be done on it. So you'll see it's a battery, buttons, a display, it has contactless, it has EMV chip, and a dynamically encodable mag stripe on the back of the card. To date, we have a, a very, very successful program in Canada. It's with CIBC Bank and Tim Hortons. This card is a payment card and a closed loop proprietary prepaid debit card, effectively. It's the first time I've seen anything like this where you have effectively two products on a card with two separate PSPs or third-party processors. So just to describe the card a little bit more to you, I press the Visa button, the contactless is activated, the EMV chip is activated, the dynamically encodable mag stripe is activated, you swipe the card, you spend, you accrue points, you walk across the street to Tim Hortons, you press the Tim Horton loyalty prepaid um, closed loop loyalty button, and you can instantly redeem your points by tapping, swiping, or dipping your card. So it's instant earn, instant burn, and it's arguably one of the most successful co-brand launches in the history of Canada. We're very proud of this product. Another product we have is more security focused, um, and it, it represents one of the areas of business we have. We obviously uh, produce these cards, but we also provide online, real-time, auth-based loyalty and security systems. So on this card, you have five buttons across the top. Um, you can enter up to a 20-digit PIN. You enter the PIN, you turn on the card, and it fully displays the PAN. You can press a toggle key, and it, per and it displays dynamic CVV. So this is DCVC1 and 2 capable on this card. This is what we call the hidden card. Something new that we've just produced and has come out this year is a three-button version of our card. You can have credit, debit, and you can have a pay with points button. And one of the things that we've recently launched on this product is lights that correspond and can make the card glow. So you can have a bank logo, you can have a, an icon, or you can have a partner logo glow based on the product that you select. So again, we have credit, debit, and points. A few other comments about our cards. Um, I know in, in Europe, where I spend most of my time, there's a large amount of concern these days about RFID theft. So one of the security components on all of our cards that's inherent is until the card is activated and turned on, none of the channels that are deployed on the card for communication of payment information can be accessed, so the card is secure. So these ideas of buying RFID, you know, wallets and what have you, it's, it's unnecessary with our card. Our card is also waterproof, it's protected against demagnification, and it's very durable and, and, and very strong. Um, again, arguably, when you look at raised pre-emboss and the degradation that exists on the card with raised pre pre or raised embossing, and the tip tipping, um, our card being laser inscribed and not having any sort of raised embossing is stronger and more durable and is a more aesthetically pleasing card. The, card of, uh, the price of the card is continuing to go down. Um, one of the things that, that I learned in coming to Dynamics, having spent 20 years in banking, um, I didn't know much about consumer electronics, but each and every day the cost of the card and the production costs come down. So now what we're telling banks and other partners is, the models support um, a, a break-even on, on these cards in some cases within a year. 
So um, over the past years, the cards have been expensive, but we've been able to show expense savings and revenue savings on the cards. I'd like to talk with you a lot more about this. Um, I'm going to try and end a little bit early to get us to that drink quicker. Um, there's a lot of information that I can share with you on this card, and I look forward to doing so outside. Uh, we have a booth, and, uh, and I would welcome um, any opportunity to speak with you. I'm Will Kiliar. Um, again, I'm Chief Payments Officer for uh, Dynamics in Europe, Middle East, Africa, and I look forward to speaking with you. Thank you.